राधे राधे जय श्री कृष्ण क्लास नाइन एंड टेन स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू विमल सर्जी यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन ए ऑफ एक्सरसाइज एलेवन पॉइंट टू यूनिट एलेवन ट्रिगोनोमेट्रिक रेशियोज ऑफ एनी एंगल्स क्लास नाइन कंपलसरी नॉट कंपलसरी दिस इज ओ पी टी मैथ्स एंड इफ यू सर्च इफ यू गो टू दिस प्ले लिस्ट ऑफ विमल सर्जी देन यू विल फाइंड मोस्ट ऑफ योर क्लास नाइन एंड टेन solutions with your exercise with this exercise name or topic chapter name so that you can easily find and the, uh, subscribe this channel if you haven't subscribed because this is totally free no any charge to subscribe the channel if you type www.facebook.com slash b-i-m-a-l-s-a-j-a-n then you will get my facebook id and if you follow me in the facebook id then you will not miss any of my newly uploaded videos so keep watching keep supporting and share with your friends if you find this video useful so let's begin the solution now prove the following cos uh, a plus b plus c is equal to cos a cos b cos c uh, into 1 minus tan a tan b माइनस टेन बी टेन सी माइनस टेन सी टेन ए सो नाउ हेयर सोल्यूशन हेर इज कॉस ए प्लस बी सो राइट दिस नाउ हेयर एल एच एस इज इक्वल टू कॉस ए प्लस बी प्लस सी नाउ दिस कॉस ए प्लस बी प्लस सी कैन रिटर्न एज हेयर कॉस and use now this okay for this to use bracket that is a plus b and then plus c we have used bracket because this uh, we will treat this as a single okay that means this whole is a and this is b okay now we will apply the formula for this this is cos a plus b okay format so cos a plus cos b formula is what cos cos a plus cos a cos b that means this is cos a this total is cos a so cos a plus b is cos a type into cos b that means cos b means this is here b type so this is c and there is uh, plus so we will use it minus now sine of a so this is a part means this is a plus b into again sine sine this is uh, b part so this is c okay that means formula for uh, cos a cos b cos a plus b formula is cos a cos b minus sin a sin b okay now now here is you can see there this is here cos a plus b so again we will apply the same formula here now for this so we will keep this in bracket now this is now here cos a plus b formula again here this is here cos a cos b with plus with the minus sin a sin b and then this cos c as it is now minus and again for this sin a plus b will use the formula sin a cos b this is plus or plus plus cos a sin b and then this sin c okay sin c okay we have used this formula only okay inside and we have taken this inside and this we have taken okay outside that means if we now uh, multiply this cos c inside we will get here cos a cos b cos c cos a cos b into cos c minus sin a sin b sin a sin b and then this cos c sin a sin b and then this cos c cos c and now this minus here again if you multiply this inside this will be now here sin a cos b into sin c and then this minus plus is minus minus uh, cos a sin b and then sin c cos a sin b and then sin c okay just uh, write in such a way that a b c a b c a b c okay a b c okay this format okay this is now 
now we can see here what is common here now we can take from here common cos a cos a cos b cos c take common because see there from this okay we have to prove okay this much so we we'll take this common this is the logic here we'll take here cos a cos b cos c common okay now this we have taken common means there is one okay one and this is now here minus and there is there is sin a sin b sin a sin b okay sin a sin b and this cos c is already already here so we should divide by how much this cos is already here so we should divide by here cos a and cos b cos a cos b okay that means when you multiply this this uh, this cos uh, this cos a cos b will cancel and we will get back here this same term sin a sin b and then cos c will get here okay same here minus common there is there is now here uh, uh, cos b right so it's sin a sin c this is here sin a into sin c and cos b part is here so what we'll do we'll write here cos a and then cos c cos a and then cos c again if we multiply back then what is cos a cos c cos a cos c will cancel and cos b will be remaining so cos b sin a sin c this is here cos b sin a sin c will get back now this minus here again from here there is uh, sin b sin c so right here sin b sin c sin b <coughs> sin c sorry so this is sin b sin c and this cos a is already here so right here this this leave it and write it cos b cos c cos b cos c and then bracket close again if you okay uh, if you multiply back uh, cos b cos c cos b cos c will cancel and remaining will be here sin b sin c cos a sin b sin c and cos b okay now oh sorry, sorry okay this was not centralized okay now let me again explain this okay see there i have taken here now for uh, this term okay for this term i have taken this minus yes and i uh, i have written this here sin b and sin c here sin b sin c and there is cos a so from here don't add this cos c just add this cos b cos c cos b cos c to check whether this is right or wrong we, if we break the okay bracket then what will we cancel cos b cos c cos b cos c will be cancelled and remaining will be here sin b sin c sin b sin c and then this part cos a okay so now we can easily write now this is here cos a cos b cos c bracket 1 minus sin a by cos a is what tan a sin b by cos b is here tan b minus sin a by cos a is sin a sin a by cos a is what tan a and sin c by cos a is tan c minus sin b sin b by cos b is here tan b and sin c by cos c is here uh, tan c okay now just okay rearrange this according to this okay so this is here cos a cos b cos c 1 minus see there in the formula there is what tan a tan b so tan a tan b right there tan a into tan b now see there is tan b tan c so where is our tan b tan c Ooh, there is for tan b tan c so write this term minus tan b tan c and after this minus there is tan c tan a so there is tan c tan a so write this here arrangingly tan c into tan a okay so one two three part one two three and this four part okay oh no here see what we have done here we have written this as it is and this third part we have written here why because there is after this is tan b tan c and then there is minus tan c tan a tan c tan a this is the tan c tan a so we have written here tan c tan a from this here so uh, this is our required solution okay hence <coughs> rhs is equal to rhs proof 
so this is the complete solution of this uh, 14a if you find this uh, useful videos helpful videos then support me by your comment and share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe this channel and follow me in the facebook page because daily i upload solutions for you okay keep patience keep watching okay very soon i will complete this class 9 and 10 both opt and compulsory maths and then i will start question bank of asmita publication or whatever the question bank comes for the SEE examination all that i will solve but one by one keep watching keep supporting see you in the next videos radhe radhe jai shri krishna